pull them on. We got 804 area code. Who do we got? Uh, this is Linda in Virginia. Good morning to all of you. Good morning to you, Linda. Thank you for calling in. Hey, Jason, I got to talk with you uh, when you were on the show with Heather. Yeah. And I was trying to reach out to Bob to find out about a dream he gave me with some numbers. Numbers. I saw you comment about the numbers. Like, is that a lot of numbers? Yeah, it's what driving me know? nuts. I'm getting old, Jason, and I'm oh. time's Time's a ticking here. I don't I'm know sure what those you numbers were. meant, but yeah. I knew there was something significant about it. All right, we can try again. So I thought, what the heck? I'll I'll try. Uh, Rob, do you want to go? Sure. All right. Bob, I'm trying to reach out to you again. I kind of want to know what that dream was with the numbers in it. I know that they were significant. Do, do you think you could help me? Oh. Yes, Bob. You want to turn up a little bit, Rob. Um, I really kind of would like to know what they meant. I know there was in the courthouse. I remember. I remember that. Yeah. Something about anxiety. Are you out there? Can you hear me? What was the number for, Bob? You know, this is crazy. Last time I tried to do this, I heard my brother, and I just heard my brother again. Really? You heard like his voice, or? Yeah, it, this yeah. happened last time we tried yeah. this. I, I was trying to reach out for Bob, and Stephen came through. And I hear Stephen. I just heard Stephen again. Oh. Yes. Sharing a secret. Stephen, are you out there? <laughs> Sounds stupid to say out there. Or in here? Yeah. Stephen, can you hear me? Three, four, three, forty-eight something. Yeah. I was just <laughs> what? I heard three forty-eight. Throwing out numbers. Like, I'll write that down. It doesn't right now it doesn't mean anything, but to not to say it won't connect to something. Right. Is it Bob or Steven here trying to talk to Linda? Ed. I'm just Ed. Go away. Bob or Steven. Bob? Ed. Steven? Uh, he said, are you out? So, are you in there? <laughs> Can um, you hear me? Yeah. Three fourteen. Some yeah. other people. I heard three forty. Some people heard three fourteen. Yeah. Is that same number again? Three forty-eight. No, some people heard three fourteen. So I'm gonna have to point that out to you. Three fourteen. Yeah. Um, is it way? Can you tell us what the numbers mean? Um, no, you're not asking me. That's really good. I don't know which way to go here. Bob, can you give me one of the numbers again? Try. Six is only number I'm just gonna pretty much eat. Yeah, Bob. I heard you. Steven, I hear you. That's right. You ready? That's right. Stephen, where are you? You need to use your energy and come through and give me some signs. Can you use that energy? So you. 
Something about being worried. So I can hear him, but I, I I can't clarify what it is he's saying. It's like, yeah, it's almost like in a low whisper. But it's his voice you're hearing. Yeah, it is his voice. I mean, this is the second time now. Yeah. I mean, that I've reached out. I don't. I really don't know where to go with that on questions for him. I mean, other than I just would like him to. Use his energy to show me that you know it's time that he is around me and that he sees what's going on. Connection. Connection. Okay. Just about. When you reveal it, you might hear a lot more and be able to make some of that out. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's like all stuff like that. I'm not getting anything from Bob. He's going to leave me hanging in the lurch here. <laughs> now I'm going to have to go to a medium. <laughs> we got these numbers. Are they a lot of numbers? <laughs> Is that a lot of numbers. We have meetings. That, you know, the only numbers I heard was the, the 358 and 6, and other people heard 314. What were the numbers that he gave you last time? It's um, I did some of them. I've got them written down somewhere because this was okay. over, golly, over ten years ago that he, my uh, stepfather, came to me in a dream, and it freaked me out because oh, in the right. dream I knew he was dead, that's and I happens. didn't understand why he came to me, and he told me, um, he told me he was looking for a room. Uh, the room was twenty one. So as I told him, you know, we could go upstairs. For some reason, we were in a courthouse. And when we were going upstairs to the room, he said, I need you to remember something. And he gave me a series of five numbers. And by this point, I'm starting to wake up and I'm just running these numbers over and over and over in my mind. Because you know how, like, when you wake up, things become splotchy. Oh, yeah. So I just kept, you know, repeating these numbers. And um, he gave me the number 21 twice, but he also gave me the number 12. And then there was um, like 51 is one of them. I don't know. I have them written down. Okay. And um, yeah. So, and, you know, I woke up, I wrote the numbers down real quick. And now it's been like 15 years. And I know that there is something significant about that dream. Well, 21. Next year, and, and will I, be 2021. You know, every, of course, you know, your mind goes automatically to the lottery, but that doesn't, yeah. you know. But next year is going to be I could 20. Go, Linda, it's going to be 2021 next year. Maybe he meant 21 for the year. See, and I was thinking that the other day because yeah. he gave me the number twice, 21. And so I'm thinking if it's going to happen, it's going to happen next year. Right. That's what I'm wondering. Which means I got to live another year. <laughs> <laughs> then you'll get your answer, hopefully, right? All right. Well, you guys have a wonderful evening. I you thought too. I'd give this a shot. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. <laughs>